What are you doing? Well, I come to hang out with you for a little while. What are you into today? Oh, I'm just messing. Sit down. All righty. Where are you going to sit? Huh? I'll sit right here. Okay. Them girls are cutting some flowers out there today. Are they? Yeah. How you been doing? Oh, all right. I reckon. Did you stay up late last night? No, why? Well, I talked to Lisa about 10 o'clock and she said you're still up. Well, I didn't set up till about 10. Yeah? About every night. She said you was going pretty, pretty strong last night. <laughs> <laughs> That must be uh I remember that battle all my life. Eating biscuit <clears throat> putting a biscuit in your coffee? Yeah. Well, I ain't never heard of that. You ain't? No, where'd you come up with that at? Well, I don't know. I've known it all my life. Is it pretty good that way? Yeah. You can put it out in the saucer if you want to your biscuit and pour your coffee in it and Eat it. Well, yeah. dang. You so, want some coffee? Oh no, I'm no, good. I don't know nothing about eating coffee and biscuits together. Well. Do you do that? Do I do that? No. I was asking where that came from. I had never heard of it. What? Yeah, he does it all the time. Let me see there. Hey, how about that? Well, maybe other people's heard of that. I don't know. Or maybe that's just something that they do here in Greasy Holler. Pretty nice day today, what do you think? Yeah. It is. It's pretty day. We better enjoy this day before it gets too hot on us. Yeah. Another few weeks, it'll be 90 degrees. Yeah. Won't be long. Probably be a hot summer. And I dread that hot summer. Oh gosh, yeah. I remember when I, about almost two years ago, I came here in June, started filming with you, and me and you went up there up on your farm up there at the graveyard, and it was so hot. It was about 95 or 100 degrees that day, I think. No, I think it was 103 degrees that day I came. It was hot. I, yeah. We don't like that hot weather. I've done a many of a day's work back there in them fields and it's hot like that. You told me a story one time about a guy that helped you in the fields that wore a coat during the summertime. Remember about a guy that wore a coat all the time? Yeah, I remember that, but I forgot who it was. He said it kept him cool, didn't it? Said ever what would keep you warm and keep you cool. <laughs> 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 who was that I forgot now well, it's been a few years ago you was telling me about it I think it's somebody maybe helped you put up hay or no maybe they was helping with the back I don't know but pepper I believe Pe pepper I believe it was I used to grow pepper oh did you yeah how much pepper did you grow I about two acres wow what'd you do sell it to people yeah, yeah? they bought it down the valley down here Oh, okay. You could just pour it out in your truck and take it down there and set it. Are you talking about like green peppers, bell peppers? Yeah. Yeah? Green. They buy green, red, stripe it, any, any kind. Stripe? I, I ain't never, <coughs> they've got stripe. You know where it wasn't ripe? Oh, yeah? Where it wasn't ripe? Some of them pick it too green, be red and, and green. Red, green. <laughs> I like, I like bell peppers. Now they didn't like that. They'd cut you way down if you took it down there like that. If you cut, brought it in and it wasn't completely ripe yet, they yeah. didn't like that, did they? Mm -mm. So, so you'd, you'd take a truckload at a time? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that's something new. I didn't know you did. Yeah. Peppers. How about that? So you've cut some flowers? Yeah, making daddy a little flower pot. Well, how about that? <laughs> he likes flower pots. I was looking all the way at the top. Yeah, that got that from Brenda. He sure has it all good, yeah. Ain't that pretty?
smell those roses, Daddy? Can you smell? Yeah, I smell them. Yeah. I'm gonna go fix it. put them in a pot. Yep. Well, you're just a regular florist, ain't you? <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm not. I like it. You're very talented. Well, How about that? You got all that right out of the yard, didn't you? Yeah, all of mom did, planted every one of these, I would say. Your mom planted them all. Yeah. How about that? She loved her flowers. A lot of them are gone, though. Oops, I just broke one. Can you believe all those poppies are gone? I know. Well, we've got a picture of her with them, though. Do you like your flower pot? Yeah, that's perfect. You like it? I'm going to set it on your table. Huh? I'm going to set it on your kitchen table. Okay, that's good. Thank you. That's pretty thought. Thank you. Pretty flowers. Thank you. She did good, didn't she? Yeah. You've sure had some uh, some good daughters, though, I tell you. What? Oh, yeah, they are. They've turned out pretty good. Yeah. They, they're right here with you, helping you out, ain't they? Yeah. They're all smart, too. Oh, yeah. Pretty too, ain't they? I, like I guess they took that from their mama because they didn't get it from you, did they? <laughs> I'm aggravating you. I guess you was a pretty handsome fella back in the day, huh? I saw them pictures when you was a teenager. Boy, you was, you was sharp back in the day, wasn't you? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good looking fella. So we'll have to figure out where this uh, biscuit and coffee tradition came from. I ate that when I was a little boy growing yeah, up. Yeah, did your mom and dad do the same thing? I don't remember, I guess. I don't know. What happened? You just drinking some coffee and dropped your biscuit in there and just kept on drinking, thought it was pretty good? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I asked a lot of questions about stuff like that. And you never do that? I No, I've never put no uh, nothing in my coffee, no biscuit, no. Where did you grow up at? Oh, I grew up down there in La Follette. Downtown. Yeah, I was lived in up on the hill. Yeah, in town. I was lived in downtown LaFalde as a kid. Them girls get in a hurry sometimes, don't they? Yeah, hell. I don't know. <coughs> when you retired like you, you don't need to get in no hurry, do you? No, I don't want to be in no hurry. Just like taking it easy and relaxing. <laughs> Did you eat breakfast this morning? Yeah. Yeah. Did you? I ate pizza, pizza. You like pizza? Pizza. You ever eat pizza? Yeah, but I ain't know. Well, it's kind of late breakfast. I was on my way up here. So, is it <coughs> late breakfast or early lunch? I ate pizza. Piece of pizza. I don't care much about pizza. I don't ever eat much. Well, you got these girls cooking these nice home-cooked meals for you. You don't have to eat that pizza. <laughs> What'd they do? Well, Lisa just left, and Joey's still here, and she's going to stay, and she's going to go with us, too, but she's going to help m make sure I get you in the car okay. It's a little bit of a walk getting up there to the car from here, ain't it? Yeah. Set that fuck bucket up there. I need, bucket. I need that cigarette bucket. Okay, there you go. Made it all right down there. Yeah, you've had a pretty good life here in Greasy Holler, haven't you? Oh, yeah. You, you wouldn't have wanted sure to live did. nowhere else, I bet, would you? I don't know. Had you ever thought about moving out of here? No, not really. Not really, just go out on vacation and See some other places and come back yeah. to the holler. Yeah. Huh? No place like home, are they? No. That lady was uh, excited to meet you. She, right there, I used to live right there in that place. That was the first place you lived, wasn't it? First place, yeah. When you moved out from your mom and daddy's, you moved there, didn't you? No, I moved there. My daddy bought that little old place. Oh, did he? Back in them days. 
and I moved in it. Oh yeah, where was you living at before that? Hell, I don't know if it's around here in the end or yet. Probably living with you still at home, wasn't you? They're working cutting trees in there. Right there it is, the frosty freeze. Yeah, there it is. See if we can get up here close so I don't have to walk so far. There's one of the ladies. Yeah. Carry out the girls. Yeah. Well, we'll sit here for just a minute and see if we can find them girls of yours. Oh, let's see. Don't know if I see them yet or not. John. Hey, what's getting ready to come in? Are you? Yeah. Good. Yeah. No, we're just getting microphone on you. Hello, Ralph. Well, howdy. How are you? All right. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I've been to a funeral. Yeah, I know. You Dang, I hate funerals. You've been where? To a funeral. Oh, my goodness. And I hate them. Uh, yeah, everybody it Reminds me of what's them. coming. Huh? Reminds me of what's coming. Oh, yeah. And I, I don't like it. <laughs> well, we're just oh, going to come in. Get to work should be here in a few minutes, Okay, too. the daughter's here, too. What's her name? Oh, when I'm already here? Uh, oh, no, I don't know. What's her name? Oh, Lisa and Joy's coming. Oh, Lisa. They had to stop and do a few things. So okay. We come on out. Glad you're okay. here. Glad you got to make it. I know. I, I sneaked out the back door, John. Yeah. Well, we kind of waited a little later to get yeah. here, so. Yeah, I sneaked out the back door, and I just come on up here. Do you own this? Yes, sir. Oh. For 44 years, John. 44 I mean, years. Uh, Ralph. I guess I've been a coming here about that long time. Well, why didn't you come in and meet me? Well, I didn't know that. Well? Well, that's what he's here today for. Come in. He wants to get a banana split, I believe. Dang. <laughs> I didn't know that. Sir. You're in for a treat. You are. Well, let me get him out here. Okay, we'll just come sorry. on in. Okay. We'll just come on in, sit down. How's that? That's fine. <laughs> We're excited to finally get him here. Let me get out of this okay. down, please. Well, he'll we'll be okay. I'll help him just a little bit, but he gets along pretty good. I'll meet you in the dining room. Okay, we'll be right in. There's one of his daughters pulling in now, I think. Okay. Hello, okay. Thank you. Yeah. I might need two though. I might want to knock somebody down. What do you think about that mm -hmm. lady? That's the one that's been wanting to meet you. That's why I it wanted is. to bring you up here. Now you know why I wanted you to come up here, right? Yeah. You did, guys? Yeah. We're going to yeah. come inside here. Alrighty. Ever since this place has been here. Well, how about that? Uh, how you doing? I'm doing well. Good to see you. That's Mr. Ralph Robertson. He oh, comes Mr. Yeah. Ralph. I'm Kenny. I work here. Good to see you. You work here. I do. You're old enough. I don't know. I work here. Don't know, John. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I got us a table back there. Okay, good. You can get around real good. Well, you do too. Well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> he said I get around real good. Yeah. Well, <laughs> welcome. welcome. You come on, welcome. sit down. I'll order you something, okay? Yeah, go on. Come oh, on, make you sit down. Is it? Who's this? This is my daughter. Is that his daughter? Yeah, it's one of them. He's got six daughters. Hey, I've got this is Joey. Oh, you're lucky. I just got two. You've got a whole bunch. Yeah. Okay. Well, we need a pillow? Oh. I don't know where I need a pillow. You got pillow? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, hell, what no, good? I have one in my what car, you but I don't today. Come on, Ralph. Now, don't be a pet in my leg or nothing, okay? Okay, I won't be a pet in your leg. <laughs> I ain't got nothing to pet for, man. I well, know that. Oh, well, have you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's so nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you. I've seen you on TV. Hey. Yeah. You're pretty popular. You're, yeah. You're pretty popular. Are you rich yet? Rich? Uh. No, they don't get paid <laughs> <me> nothing. <laughs> I don't get nothing well, for my work. You don't? Shoot. No. Hey, John. How you doing? No. 
This is the first time I've been here in a long time. Is it But right? I've been coming here since this place has been here. I've been here since 1978. Almost every day. 70? Yeah. 45 years. So. I guess I've been coming here that long. Well, I wished I'd have known it. I'd have brought you a milkshake out there. <laughs> You're doing great to be your age. Buddy. You are, Ralph. Huh? Yeah. Let's see. Shifty Grove, that's what's on that sign there. And you turn off there and then go on down the river towards the lake. I bet it's so pretty down there, isn't it? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I saw you I saw you on t on YouTube and you were Come sitting. Come on down, I'll put you up all night. Well, now I want to sit on the swing. Huh? I want to sit on your swing on your front porch. Sit on the porch? Yeah, I went on the swing. What? Okay. Yeah, I do now. Because I saw you on TV and you were sitting out there and it was raining, I think, one day. and it, Or it was sunny or something. But I saw you sitting on that porch and I said, gosh, that looks so good. It is a good place. Yeah. I mean, it's a, I still like it. Yeah, I do too. So that's our net around. Get the office. That'd be great. You want something to eat? Yeah, we're going to get something to eat. Well, you better get your banana split. You know we make the best hamburgers in America, don't you, Ralph? Well, yeah, you make good hamburgers. Yes, we do. But I ain't eaten her in here in a long time. Well, they're still I the same. It's still the same. But I've been coming here off and on for ever since it's been here. 1956. Yeah. He probably was here today and open. <laughs> 1956. Yeah, we opened. Well, I, I guess I was here the same year. Yeah. I know it was, really. You'd have been 30 years old when it opened up. Well, that's... There's one of my daughters right there. Do you want anything to drink? Huh? Do you want anything to drink? Uh -huh. Do you want something to drink? Yeah, I will in a few minutes. Okay. That's my daughter. Right? Yeah, she's a beautiful woman. She is. And what's her name, Joy? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, she's a pretty girl. What'd you do with all them girls, Ralph? How in the world did you... What'd you do with all them girls you raised? What'd I do what? What'd you do with all them girls? I bet there's boys everywhere in your oh, yard all the time. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. I bet you that was hard to handle. Why? Well, I mean, I, I don't know. I've got... <laughs> I got two girls. Are you a girl, aren't you? Yeah, I am. <laughs> She's saying she had two court girls, and that's hard enough to deal yeah, with. Yeah, I had, well, I had two girls, and they were hard to deal with. I don't know how you dealt with six. I don't know how. I don't know how you did it, Ralph. No wonder you're, you're still alive. But, who, but who's taking care of you now, your daughters? And that's when they come in handy. You yeah. Know? Come clean your house. Do they come and cook for you, Ralph? Yeah, yeah. Well, they could. Biscuits, gravy? Just everything, yeah. Dang, you're lucky. They some of them with me about all the time. Oh, I got yeah, saved. you're lucky. You're lucky. You're blessed. Yeah. Yeah. I figured I'd have to save myself when my wife died. But that's not I don't happen. That's not, that don't happen when you got girls. Because the girls don't ever leave you. Yeah. I found that out. You got girls, Two. Too. That's all yeah. I got, two girls. And they're right there, Johnny, on the spot to help me anytime I need them. Yeah. They are. Well, that's real. They work here, don't they? They sure, they sure do. And so do my granddaughters. My granddaughters work here, too. So. Yeah, he didn't feel too good yesterday, but he's feeling better today. Oh. Yeah, I feel oh. better today. Well, that's good. He was going to come yesterday, and he just didn't want to get out. Yeah. So we sat on the porch. Did oh, you? Oh, I love sitting on the porch. We should have come down and you can sit on it. Well, I will, Ralph. I'll come down to Greasy Holler and see you. Well, I okay. will. You going to have your daughters cook for me, make a pie or I something? I can tell you just exactly how to get there. Well, I need something to eat when I get there. I, I don't <laughs> know if I'll have any pie. Well, you'll have a pie and get one of them I girls to make you some... might bring something. Well, okay, I can do that. <laughs> huh? I can do, I can do that. <laughs> yes, I, I can do that. You look like that. Well, what, I'll tell you what. I'll bring the hamburgers, and you you have one of them girls make us a pie or a cake or something, and we'll have dessert. Oh, that'd be fun, won't it? Okay. If we're there, it is there, not gone. Never can tell about it. Well, I know. 
But it's good to meet you. It's good to meet you. Thank you. It's good You've to meet been you. here for years. 40, 45. See, I don't think I should have known you back in. Yeah. I was in here, too. Huh? I was in here, too, working. What? Yeah, absolutely. I sure was. I've been here ever since it's open, but I ain't been here now a pretty good bit. Certainly. You was here last year with yeah, one of I've your daughters. Here. because Oh, I, I'm here. I've been here more than once a year. They was here last year. Remember before I came I remember to that. You, I remember that. I told you that just a, a few months before that, we were going down to Pickers Paradise, and we always stop here and eat. And he was out there with one of his daughters. They'd come got some food. He was eating outside. So. Cool, yeah. Well, I don't ever see I've anybody never outside. I've come in here much. I've been in here before. He usually eats outside. Yeah. I used to eat in my car outside or pick up. I had a truck. Well, food tastes better in your car, Ralph. Does it? Yeah. Yeah. When you come in here and eat it, I look out there and those people are eating in the car, and I say, God, that's starving me to death. I'm starved <laughs> to death. It's always better in the car. <laughs> <laughs> What is Ralph eating today? He's having a banana split, I think. Oh. Everything's better in the car. <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> what, was your, what was your first car, Ralph? Do you huh? remember your first car? Yeah. Tell me about it. It's a model. Oh, a model converter. Poop. Dang. Yeah, man. Boy, I bet you was I a hot... I bought that thing for $35. You was hot stuff, Ralph, wasn't you? You was hot stuff, wasn't you? In that yeah. convertible car. Tell, 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 tell her what happened about that, your daddy's gas pump. Remember that story you told me about backing oh. up? Oh, yeah, I backed into it and knocked it down. Oh, gosh. And my daddy was standing right out there with us when it fell down. It was on Sunday. Two or three people are walking around. We've seen them this Sunday. And... Uh, I said, well, let's go back. I put it in reverse and backed up right real fast. Hey, Hit that Mama. guy's bum, talked it down. <laughs> they never did put it back up. Oh, they never did? Never oh, wow. did. They put them out of the guy's bum. Did it really? Yeah. They are. Sure did. This one of them old pumps, you know, had the glass on top. Yeah, yeah. 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 Wow. He, got, he, did, he had a bad bicycle wreck one time. He got liquored up, didn't he? Oh, yeah. I had to like, kill myself with a bicycle. <laughs> was you drunk? Was, huh? you, was you drunk? I drunk liquor. Moonshine liquor. Oh, oh my Lord. Oh, oh. Did you ever drink any moonshine? Hell yes. <laughs> Do you? Yes, yeah, yeah. absolutely. But I like that, that apple stuff that they make now. That, that stuff back in the old days, whoo, it burned all the way down. <laughs> it did, it it did, Ralph, burned all the way down. Well, yeah, it did sometimes. I don't know why Some we... Some of it was real hot now. I'm yeah. How in the world did we enjoy that? I don't know. I don't know either. For the effects of it, I guess. <laughs> if that hadn't had no effects, we wouldn't have drunk it. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no. Oh, and you wouldn't have wrecked that bicycle. Yeah, I'd been out there to Sunday school down the road about a mile, a little over a mile from where I live. And uh, I was riding my bicycle. And I was coming home. Uh, <clears throat> we got right up on top of the hill, Greasy Holler. I decided I'd come back in that way and I went. I went down that hill of peddling fast as I could and <laughs> hit a place where they'd hauled a bunch of rocks in to fill up a mud hole and wrecked right there. Dang. Hit me all over. <laughs> <laughs> there wasn't a place on me but I wasn't. My hands on both sides, inside and out, and my elbows, shoulders. I ever will. I skin that, all over. That may be what you get for getting drunk on Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah. Tell them what about your hands. They had to do to your hands. Tell her what the, the doctor did about your hands. The skin did you, yeah, go, it peel, did you go to the doctor? Pulled that up. Oh, yeah. Peeled it off like that. <laughs> that skin was laying. He took big scissors and pulled that up and oh. cut it off. Oh. 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 The doctor did. They took me oh, you was tough, wasn't you? They took me to the doctor. He 
wasn't tough. He's he's still drunk. You're still drunk. It didn't hurt. I guess it was. That's funny. Now my daddy, he would have whooped me all over if he knew about drinking. Yeah, he would have. Your daddy didn't know then, right? No. Your daddy didn't know. Got into moonshine. Uh, His daddy didn't drink any, did he? Oh no, he he hated liquor. He never did drink it. I don't believe he ever. I doubt if he ever did taste of it in his lifetime. He used to be a school teacher. He teached school for about twenty years. Oh, did he? Where did he teach at? Huh? Where did he teach at? Where did he teach? Yeah, what school did he teach at? He teached all around down below Greasy Hollow and across the river. Really? Pleasant Point and really? over in there. Oh, okay. Yeah. My mother was a school teacher and she taught till I was born and then she quit. Uh, well, what's your name now? I was an Arnold and where we lived. Uh, what? Arnold. Her name is Penny Arnold. Penny Arnold. Well, we lived, that was called Greasy Hollow back then. We lived down uh, next to the bend that goes right to the river where you could cross over into La Follette. And they called that Greasy Hollow. So, I don't know. It was on the other side of the bridge. When the bridge was yeah. there, they called the other side of the bridge Greasy Hollow too. Remember? Yeah. That was Bunches Hollow. Bunches Hollow. Well, well, yeah, Bunches Hollow's still down there. Yeah, yeah it's still there. Yeah. But Greasy Hollow used to probably cross, cross when the bridge was well, up. They was the bridge. They called that Greasy Hollow where we lived. There was a store right at the end of the bridge. What was he around? Uh, what was the store? Remember? What the name of it yeah. was? I don't know really what the name of it was. That said, I believe it was a Williams that owned it. Did they tell her how many stores used to be on that one road at one time? Uh, Wasn't there a bunch of stores on? Oh that? yeah, they stored everywhere back there. That more country. Oh yeah. See, that road was the main road. If you was over here and you was going down towards the Follett, you'd cut over three bunches holler over that bridge and you'd save one. Oh yeah. yeah. You'd save the time going all the way oh, around. I see. Okay. You know where bunches holler? Yes, I did. Do you? Yes, I did. So if you was on that side and you wanted to go to Knoxville, you'd cross that bridge coming this way. And end up into Sharp's Chapel and yeah. places like that. Yeah. So that's when the bridge, when the dam came in, it was too, the lake was too big for the bridge. They took the bridge out. Okay. They said they'd put one back, but they never did. Never did do it. Mm. They would have it. To the squares hadn't sold it out. Yeah. They sold it out. They wouldn't wouldn't vote for it to be put back. They didn't want to spend that money, did they? That was the, that was the problem with that. They'd have had to build the bridge back. They couldn't just tear a bridge out and let it go for nothing. It killed, it, it hurt the business then, so that was oh, a dead yeah. end road, so then the store started dying off. I see. Yeah. The, theirs was the last store, I guess yours was the last store open in Greasy Hall, or you used the last well, your store stayed open longer than anybody else, didn't it? And well, they was one down the lake, too, just Kaywood. Okay. Yes, Kaywood Hall. What was your father's name? John Robson. You ever know him? No. Where have you raised that? Right here. Sandley. South Tad. South Sandley? Yeah. I'm, that's where I live now. I was born and raised in San Luis, but I've now traveled all the way around the world, practically. But I settled back in San Luis. San Luis. Yeah. Is it's, that place in Paul? It's close, mm -hmm, down in there. And we've got uh, Johnson's Mill. You know where Johnson's oh, Mill? Oh yeah, that, I, I live within a half a I walk where of that. Johnson's Mill is. That's where I live, right? I believe I've got people buried in that cemetery down well, there. Well, by George, that's where I live. Right to Johnson's Mill. I go down there two or three times a month and get cat food from, from Jimmy. Who? Mm hmm. And John. Mm hmm. Did you ever do any business with uh, John Johnson? I used to go there with my daddy to the yeah. mill. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably when the bridge was still in, what? Yeah. 
go across the bridge. Yeah. yeah. Johnson's Mill, it, they stopped the wheel from running. You know, they can't do that legally anymore. But he's still got a big business down there, Ralph. He has? Yes, absolutely. Big business. What do they do? They still want to do They sell uh, lawnmowers and tractors and... And, and I, I get cat food down there. They sell corn and cow's food and all that stuff. You go to the general store? No, no. They sell boots. Sell boots. Yeah. And belts and that's hats. Where, hats. That's where we're getting fireworks on the 4th of July. So you need to go down well, there. That's where I'll go. To you need to go down there and see them. People. I will. They're wonderful. Yeah, they I are. will. I'll go. Okay. That's good. I'll put them on YouTube again. Yeah, they still got that big wheel, but it don't work. They don't run it anymore. Don't run it, yeah. yeah. I guess the government stopped that from happening. What's the reason? Well, why was the purpose of that? Well, I guess they didn't want them stopping and starting that creek that run down through there. You know, that's where they got their powers from that water. Yeah, I know. So they wouldn't let them divert the creek, I don't think, to do to maintain that wheel. Well, it just went down through an old I know wheel. It. Right I don't back know. In the I creek. don't see nothing wrong with that, do you? No. Did you ever remember it being in works and seeing it working? Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Well, we, yeah. We got we got uh, corn and meal and and wheat and stuff down there when we when I was growing up. See, I grew up down there. How old are you? I told you, seventy four. And, and proud. 74? Yeah. Well, you're not old enough to remember that. <laughs> yes, I do, Ralph. I remember that. I used to go down there and get flower sacks and make dresses out yeah. of them. He's got kids over there, new Martha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and there's one of them right in here. I see yeah, them. Right. Right. right there, they They're are. over there talking to her husband. Right over there. Yeah. Two of them, right there. Yeah, he's entertaining. Who's the other gentleman here? That's, that's your husband. That's Dean Neal, yeah. Dean. Okay. We all graduated together. Yeah. Okay. yeah. We're classmates, and we've been to a classmate's funeral. Oh, tonight. Which, okay. which I don't like to go to funerals. I don't like it. I don't go, Ralph. Well, I don't, I don't like it. I don't go. Coffee and ice cream. Can't beat that, can you? Hey, Dean, your food's ready. Put that down there, buddy. What you got there, buddy? Did you get nothing? Well, I got this hamburger and onion rings for me. Do you okay. want some of them? You want a nope. hamburger too? No, go ahead and eat that, John. Here, let me get you some napkins. John's here. taking care of himself, ain't you, John? John likes his hamburgers. He, <laughs> I eat here every time I come to New Tazel or Tazel. I eat here every time. So Thank you. Oh, you I do? I coming and going. See, that's why we're still... That's, I eat, then when I leave, I start giving out a split. That's I've why we're still here. I've been here a long time. I, I've eaten. I didn't eat out in my car most of the time. I've been yeah, in here. I bet here you won't know what we're not. You know, Martha, you'll find out when she's here and you'll come I'm up here. here. I'm here all the time. Yeah. Whenever he's here, I'll be here. That's right. We just got to tell her you're coming. She come in just to see you. She don't. She she's got them daughters that help work, so she don't have to be here all the time. She can she can get out and enjoy life a little bit. Yes, that's what I'm doing too. But now I'm here a lot. Yes, she is. I come up here for food and money. When I need to eat or when I need money, Ralph, I'm coming up here to get them, get it. Eat that stem? Don't eat that stem. I ain't going to eat that stem. <laughs> right. I ain't drunk yet. <laughs> ain't a drop of moonshine in that <laughs> banana split. But there might be in that cherry. Why don't we soft it up? <laughs> you eat that cherry? You yeah. Got teeth then? You got the picture of that I cherry? I got it. I believe I'm just going to get Ralph to come over and cut my hay. Well, I think I would, too. There you go. He'd probably do better than most. probably do better than anybody. What? Could you come over and cut my hay? I just got 10 oh, acres. Hey, you like. <laughs> That's too far to come. <laughs> I've, I've got my own tractor. You have? Yeah. It's a Kubota. Oh, Kubota? Uh -huh. I don't know about a Kubota. He's got an American-made tractor, more likely John Deere or Ford. <laughs> Don't you I've got an international, international and a Ford. Well, that's what we had, an international and a John Deere. We had all three of them. You know what he's got? He's got a farm oil, which is yeah, international. Yeah, we had one of those so He bought it new in 1950, so he's yeah. had 73 yeah. years. Yeah, I bought it brand new. Dad got it. My Ford, too. Yeah, cool. I didn't buy no second hand. I bought new stuff. 
Down the Hey, Daddy, this is Mark. He, he works at the bank, and I used to go to church with him. Yeah. Who? Mark Hickey. His name is Mark Hickey. Mark Hensley. Hickey. 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 Now, I've never met him. He don't know me. Yeah. yeah. No, I don't know. I don't know him either, <laughs> to be honest. Well, you, you know each other now. I know who and you is. And this is uh, John Ward. Oh. Yeah, I watched his videos yeah. a lot on YouTube. Yeah. Well, Ralph's on, he's one of our stars on there, Ralph. The Ralph is, is so. a star. Yeah. Well, I'll have to go home and look it up. Here. <laughs> yeah, he's a greasy hauler. I watched members. the one you did here on the Frosty. He did a good then, job, didn't he? Did. Sure yeah, he did. really did. And then uh, when you went up Mitchell's place up there on Poplar Road. Oh, yeah. I like no. that one. That's one of my favorites. Yeah, they got a nice place up there, don't they? I've not even been to that one. You have to go up there and listen to them play music sometimes. Oh, yeah. I would yes. love to do that. I, I would play music. Do I would love to do that. See all that stuff he's got in there. His wife is a professional violinist. Yes, she That was just a yeah, playing at the Grand Ole Opry not is. long ago. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's good. good. Yeah. They are, too. I filmed them. But see, I can't play none of it on YouTube because it's copyrighted, you know? I oh. filmed them in a little bit of instrumental oh, yeah. and they cut, flagged me on it. I tagged really? me on it because it's copyright music, yeah. you know? Uh, really good memories people did of going yeah. to the store as a kid, you know? That's I think good. I asked you before about a general store you going to as a kid, didn't I? Did you have one? Yeah, I do. I, I did. It was a fake cars grocery store. Yeah. And, it, and as it turns out, that's where I live today. I mean, right up on the hill by Fake Cars Grocery Store. It's where we voted, or not yeah. me, my grandfather voted okay. there. And we'd go get a grape ale. They had a store where I'd go with it. Not now. Well, it's different. It used to be, they sold gas, they sold grape heads. That was my favorite drink. Them little tiny grape heads. Yeah. Oh mm -hmm. my gosh, I love those things. And if I was real good, my dad would get me one. What was the name of the store now? Cars Grocery Store. They, yep. Fake car. Do you remember that store, Ralph? Cars? Where was it located? It was there? next, it's next, right next to Johnson's Mill. Johnson's Mill. On the other side of the road? No, it's right, it's north. Right at the bottom of my hill, bottom of my driveway. Is that cars. store still there? The store's still there, but the it's building not. Now. Yeah, the building, but not the original yeah. store. They got, what they got in it now? Nothing, it's, Nothing. it's for sale. Yeah. It's for sale. Yeah. But that's at the end of my driveway, where the cars grocery, uh, car store is. You get a bologna sandwich in there. You get some worms to go fishing. Man, I hate. I've made a many of bologna. Sandwiches. I bet you have. Did I've you cut it? it. Did you cut it off that big, that big old yeah. roll? Yeah. Crown bologna. Dang. That's the best. It I'd was. like to have me a big bologna sandwich, wouldn't you? Next yeah. time you come crackers. up here, we'll have one. Bologna and crackers. I like crackers on bologna. Yeah. Yeah. He taught me something when he was talking about. The he said he'd sell them on crackers, and I'm like, Yeah, well, they used to have crackers about this size. Oh, yeah. With yeah. four, four, four pieces. Four oh, yeah. Together. yeah. Yeah, you can make a sandwich out of that. Yeah, there. I didn't say I don't remember that. Well, you're too young. Yeah, well, he taught me those things. I learned go. about that. Four, four pieces connected together. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, and you get a piece of bologna and some cheese, and you put four down here, and the bologna and cheese, and then four on top. I remember when I used to sell a Blown in cracker for a dime. <laughs> Did you really? Yeah. Yeah. Shoot. Back in the store there about yeah. the first day ever done. So they could tell you they wanted on bread or crackers, either either all. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They'd tell me what they wanted on it and I'd charge them what I put on it. Yeah, yeah. You charge if they want lettuce and tomato yeah. and cheese, yeah. everything costs a little extra. Everything costs. <laughs> I guess there's some people come in that support they could only afford to buy a cracker. But uh -huh. <laughs> I could put them on bread or what? Crackers either one that wanted. I, I, told, I told Ralph that my maiden name is Poor. P O O R E. And poor. I, poor. Poor. I told you. And I couldn't wait to get married. Oh, really? Oh, I couldn't wait to get rid of that name. Oh, how about you know? that? So. How about that? She, I was a poor in, in name and everything. Poor? Poor, yeah. P-O-O-R-E, poor. Oh. My father's was Claude Poor. My grandfather was Parlin Poor. It was all a bunch of poors. Yeah. <laughs> Whole family of poors down in that hall. There used to be some poors bib over around. 
greasy holler, but I don't remember none, no, none now. Yeah. Mm. Number 12. Yeah. Number 12. Yeah. Number 12. Are you about ready to go home? I'm ready. Yeah, I bet you're ready for a cigarette, aren't you? Yeah, I am. <laughs> I did. We'll walk outside and you can smoke in the car, okay? Huh? We'll go out and get you in the car, okay? They don't let you smoke in the restaurant. Good no meeting you. It's good to meet you, too, Ralph. Well, okay. I hope we see each other again sometime. We will. Okay. We He's will. got a birthday right. coming up June 22nd. We will. We'll. I don't know if they're going to do something for well, you. I'll manage to come see you. Oh, that'd be wonderful. That'd be wonderful. I'll come over and see you, and we'll sit on that swing <laughs> on your porch. What do you think about that? Okay. That'll be fun, won't it? Yeah. You still have to make me a pie. Pie. Mm -hmm. I got to have a pie. I ain't okay. got no pie. Well, though. you can have your daughters make one. What kind of pie are you talking about? Not chocolate. I don't like chocolate. What about pie. apple? That'd be good. That'd be good. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do it. <laughs> well, I'm going to get back into work, and I, I, I'm so happy to meet you. I'm glad to meet You've you. You've made my day. I'm glad to meet you, okay. too. Ralph, you come back and see us. Oh, I will. Okay, bye-bye. I'll see you, bye. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See y'all. We had a good visit. He's made some new friends. Boy. I said, you made some new friends, didn't you? Yeah. You had a good visit. You want me, you want me to drag you back home? Let's see. I can drive you home. I'll take you. Okay. I can take you home. Okay. Where are your car? Right it's just up. right over here. You're going back down there, John? Well, I guess I'm going to go on home since I've been here with you for two days. was here yesterday, and then I'm going to go home and do a few things. But I'm going to try to come back next week. You're going on down the valley. Yeah, since she's got to go out greasy holler, you can ride back with her. I trust you with her, maybe. Okay. <laughs> well, Ralph, I'm sure glad you got to make some new friends in there today. Oh, yeah. Yeah, got to make some good friends there, didn't you? Guys, it's good to see y'all. Be careful now. Bye-bye.